got to get better today. What I want to know is who's ready to work. I'm ready to work. Are you ready to work? If you are, then go out and prove it to me. Show me what you got. Well, fellas, there's not a whole lot I can say about that performance today. We have high aspirations as a team. If we want to get there, we got to raise our game. Because if we repeat what I saw out there today at our next practice, it is going to be a very long season. We can do better. So, I'm sitting here in my room, and I get a call out of nowhere, and it is an Ohio area code. So, I pick up the phone, and it said, Mr. Porkchop, we would love for you to become the starting quarterback of our Cleveland Browns. I couldn't believe it. They said Kessler wasn't doing well, RG3 is out, McCown's out, and Pryor is a wide receiver, even though he was a quarterback at Ohio State in college. So, I had to uproot my entire life, leave my family, my friends, and my girlfriend behind, to go to Cleveland to become the starting quarterback of the Cleveland Browns. Now, they told me I had a tall order to work with. It's 15 touchdowns in this season, or I lose my contract and I don't come back next year. So I have to get 15 touchdowns and win some games to prove that I am eligible to be the starting quarterback for the future. So, I gave them one condition. If I do this then they have to buy me a house and they have to have my girlfriend fly out and move in with me to this house in Cleveland because if I become the starting quarterback, I can start my life in Cleveland, even though I think Texas is better. So I have a tall order to work with. Like I said, look at those team stats. Not so good. They pretty much need me. So without further ado, here we go. I go into <laughs> Ball Brown Stadium in Cincinnati, Ohio. The 5-1 Cincinnati Bengals, top of the division, and we are third to, uh, third to last, I believe, in this division. So once again, like I said, I just out of the frying pan, which is Texas, into the fire, which is Ohio. So there's Coach Marvin Lewis, and Hugh Jackson is on the opposing side. There he is giving me some words of encouragement as I go out on my first NFL snap. Isaiah Crowell in the back field, and I am nervous, if you can tell, so I toss it to him, and he picks up great yardage, and here's my first attempt of at the NFL quarterback, first attempt, and there goes Terrell Pryor down the field, nobody's going to catch him, he's got to get away from the cop speed, first career throw ever becomes a touchdown, just so amped. So one down, 15 to go. A little bit later, Isaiah, Isaiah Crowell gets it again. There I go again. About to get the second touchdown, and it doesn't come to pass. And I almost get in with one yard and drop there. And then I dump it off to Crowell. He finishes the job. Touchdown, Cleveland Browns. So we go to a little bit later. I throw. Not what I wanted, but that's okay. Throw again, and a first down picked up on third down attempt. Awesome. There we go again, right back to the guy that got the touchdown earlier, I believe, prior. So I decided to run to pick up some yards, and my fat ass didn't pick up a single yard. Awesome. So, and I get sacked. First NFL sack. Didn't feel so good, I will tell you that much. So I dumped the ball off. They go, 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 first down. At this point, I'm just trying to gain a little bit of momentum going into half, so I throw a ball downfield and just caught by Josh Gordon. We call a timeout. I dumped the ball off. It is incomplete. So I decided to throw it again. Doesn't get picked up. Now into the second half, we start in our own territory. Crowell picks up what, what he can. He picks it up again, does what he can, and now it's up to me to pick up this first down, and I get it by throwing it to my security blanket, it seems. So we go, go, go. Crowell runs again. Fantastic speed. Love this guy. And then we go. Oh, almost a first down. So second nine later. I almost get sacked again, but I get rid of it just in time. And I get rid of it just in time again. So Crowell just grinding and grinding, picking up the yards. He was the real cowbell of the run game. And I throw a ball and it gets dropped. Just unbelievable. Third and down. Don't get it. That's okay. Crowell once again up the middle. 
and then Crowell once again to the right. Crowell did a lot of running in this game. And there we go again, more running from Crowell. Isaiah, man, just picking up those yards the way he can. Okay, so a little later on. At this point, we're just trying to get past the two-minute warning. And, and Marvin Lewis can't believe it. His 5-1 team is getting crushed by our Cleveland Browns. Crowell runs again, and that is going to be pretty much it for me. I don't throw a single pass after this. We pick up the first down, it's over. If not, they have a chance to get it. And we are just short, but it doesn't matter. We pick up the win. Marvin Lewis cannot believe it that he lost to the Cleveland Browns in his own home field, the jungle, Paul Brown Stadium. Went in there, Andy Dalton is just flustered. And here come the two coaches. Coach Jackson, I appreciate you so much giving me this opportunity become the starting quarterback a little old guy from West Texas A&M becoming the starting quarterback for the Cleveland Browns get my first victory every point we scored was in the first quarter while the Bengals scored one touchdown the set in the second quarter and that was it defense held strong had three takeaways like I said and here are some highlights of me just picking up yardage just grinding and grinding is the reason we won this game grinding is just the absolute best solution to beat a team you just pick up those yards when you need to. You rush, you throw, and right here, Crowell gets the big touchdown that broke the Cincinnati Bengals back, and there's the first touchdown I ever had in the NFL. First passing attempt, I should say. Statistically, they beat us, except for in scoring and takeaways. We took away the ball three times from them. We had more points, but they had more passing, rushing, and yards per average. And I just so... Happy. I'm just so excited that the Cleveland Browns gave me a chance to be the starting quarterback. And so tune in next week for another big hurdle that I have to face. I already have one touchdown. Let's see how many more I can get. 14 to go.